So for today's project, all you will need is a pair of scissors. So uh, to start things off, you want to put the cord through hole one, uh, as seen in figure A, and tie it off. I also suggest numbering the holes uh, based off of figure A. This is what it should look like when you're done. Next, weave the vertical supports. Take the free end of the cord and lace it down through the corresponding hole on the other side of the frame. Continue until you have six vertical cords. Next, weave the horizontal supports. Using the cord from hole 12, lace diagonally through hole 13 to begin the next row. Continue until you have six horizontal supports. Next, we have a second set of vertical supports. Using the cord from hole 24, lace diagonally through hole 11 to begin the second row. When you're done, it should look like this. Next, we have a second set of horizontal supports. Beginning with hole number two, lace diagonally through hole number 23. This time, as you lace to hole 24, Weave over one vertical support and under the next. Continue to create the pattern shown. You may need to tweak your vertical supports. When you're done weaving, it should look something like this. You may choose to stop at this point by running the remainder of the cord through all perimeter holes before tying a knot to finish. Steps six and seven are optional on this project. This was my finished project. Thank you for watching.